Ready, guys? See moss, touch moss. <laughs> Hey guys, it's a cold morning. Wow, I'm hiking with my jacket on. It's ridiculous. Um, yeah, that was probably the coldest night so far. Actually, I gotta figure out what to do. My sleeping bag is like a 22, catabatic, and everything that I've read says that um, they're like true degrees um, on the catabatics. But I was a little bit chilly last night, um, even with this, uh, even with my down jacket on. So I don't know. My, I don't have the straps, so I want to place on the straps, placing it, placing the blame on the straps, not having them. Ooh. So let's the air out. Sounds like something's up in the hills. Um, but now I'm at a beautiful water source. Beautiful. So, I'm going to get some water now. This water source has lots of tiny fishes in it. <laughs> so, Indy's having a nice little pedicure. <laughs> Feels good. So many fishes. in the bottom. Yeah, they love going in between the toenails. Just climbed up this, and then it instantly changes into this. It's pretty neat. Just you go over a lip, whole new scenery. Whoa! <laughs> Sorry, the video. There's a step I didn't see. I think this is the Blue Ridge Parkway in Virginia. So that's that's neat. And we're going over to the Overlook. There you are to overlook where you can see Taylor Mountain. Just following the parkway right up there. That also means we're just walking with this nice view. This is interesting. And it goes down. But yeah, right next to this big wall. Hey, whoa, going downhill. So. Also, I am not feeling very well today. Feeling like the early onset of a cold uh, kind of thing. The sore throat and the, uh, yeah, just not feeling good. So, instead of doing, well, we're going to do 17 and then possibly further than that. But actually, I'm going to stop at the shelter before that one and just do, hmm, what is it, maybe like an 11 mile day. Um, I like that 11 miles is like an easy day now. That's kind of, now it's pretty ridiculous. But, uh, but yeah, when you're out here this long, 10 mile days are just, uh, that's like baby, baby step.
<laughs> no, it's not, not, not accurately. No, not actually. Wow, alright. I mean, you have to go 0.2 miles downhill to get to it, but they got an awesome fire pit here and a nice, nice shelter at Boblet's Gap Shelter. Look at that fire pit, that's crazy. And then we got water just, just right there. Maybe you can't see it, but it's literally just a few steps away. Look what we made. Do you know what number fire this is? No. I got no idea. But this was our fastest. We built up to these big logs so fast. We barely needed any kindling. It was awesome. And now it's like super stable. We haven't had to add any fuel to it. Like fuel meaning wood or sticks. For like 15 minutes. So we are becoming very good fire people.